welcome to my channel. So this is my update for Pi, which is pan and everything. And this was started by Jessica. And everybody that is in this club, they will all be listed down below. There is no end date for this. And you guys are more than welcome to join uh, whenever you want to. And I know that there are a ton of people that have joined and I'm just really, really excited about that. And I'm just, I am loving this project so much. More than I ever thought that I would this year. I've really just decided to kind of step out of my comfort zone a little bit and do things that I just, and pan in a way that I'm not used to. And that it, because if you guys know, I start and then I finish an item. So it's really hard for me to stop right after I hit pan. So, you know, this is definitely a learning experience, but I want to get some use out of my blushes and my highlighters. I'm not really bringing in eyeshadow except the ColourPop that I brought in with the glitters. But, you know, that's just because I still want to go ahead and move those out. I do plan on bringing in eyeshadow at some point. It's just not going to be right now. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys some things and some stuff. The first one I want to go ahead and show you is this Fenty Beauty highlighter that I've been using. And this is in Sandcastle. And I brought it in last time and I really thought it was going to be too dark. But it's not. I used the right brush for it and uh, it took some doing. But I think it's absolutely beautiful. Absolutely just beautiful. And this has actually replaced my favorite highlighter, which is MAC Soft and Gentle, which just surprises me. What surprises me even more is that it looks like I haven't even used it. There's not a dip. There's not anything. You still see, obviously, the embossing of the brand and just, yeah, yeah, it looks like I haven't even used it, but I swear I've been using this every day. So I think this is going to take a whole lot longer to hit pan than I originally thought. But you know what? That's okay because I love it and I'm okay with that. So, you know, it is what it is. Now I am going to show you the next thing and that is the Darling Girl Blush uh, in Splendora. I went ahead and it started off as a loose and I pressed it. And this is one of my favorite, favorite blushes. In fact, I'm wearing it today. It is like a purple pink. And this is what it looks like now. Uh, whenever I hit pan, I just kept going because, again, that is just my nature. So I figured, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and just use it until the update. So, as you can tell, I have hit major pan. And I am really happy about that. And, in fact, I kind of want this. In fact, I know I want this out this year. So in between updates, I think I'm going to actually use this. If I hit pan on a blush or something, I'm going to end up using this in hopes of getting it out this year. So just, it's, that's just my thing. So next I'm going to show you is this ColourPop uh, glitter palette. It's one of their glitter palettes. I think it's the oldest one. I got the newest uh, glitter palette for Christmas and this is what it looks like. So as you could tell right here, I do have pan and this one is called Castaway. So I have been using that predominantly every day whenever I was doing the blue looks and I just absolutely loved it. Uh, and right now I have been using this one right here and that one has got a huge dip in it as well. So I'm, I'm really enjoying the heck out of these glitters. They are just, they're stunning. They're just stunning. So, you know, I'm casually using this. I kind of just go with whatever works with the look. So no pressure there at all. But by the end of the year, hopefully I will have hit pan or used it all or something. We'll see. I would like to eventually just use it all. That would be, that would be great. So, uh, because I went ahead and I hit pan and a blush, I'm going to go ahead and bring in another blush. And this one is Makeup Forever. This came in a uh, Sephora Play a long time ago. And this one is an S S214. And it's really, really small. And it is 0 0.04 ounces. So, it's not even the same size as an eyeshadow. And that's what that looks like. It's really, really pretty. And honestly, I've only ever swatched it. I have never used it on my face. 
And that is what that looks like. So I really think I'm going to enjoy using it. I like the picky type of blushes, really neutral. It doesn't have any glitter or anything else. So I really think I'm going to enjoy it. Not exactly sure if I'm going to need to uh, put this in another uh, pan or not because it's kind of awkward. But we'll see. We'll see. But I really think that I will be able to go ahead and hit pan on this before the next update. So let's hope. So that is all that I have for you guys today. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And definitely don't forget to go ahead and check out everybody that is listed in the description box below. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.